tonight. Welcome to the Pumpkin Grove Hotel. Do you have a reservation? No? That's alright. We still have some rooms available if you want to check in. Okay, and would you want a one bed, a two bed, and what sizes? Alright. And for that size, we actually have two rooms available with different views. One of them faces the mountain and the other one faces the lake. Do you have a preference? Okay. Alright, and then to continue the check-in process, may I have your ID? Awesome, thank you. And here's this back for you. Alright, and then may I have a credit card to go along with that? Okay, so the room is yours. So let me just finish with the process. So can I ask, how did you hear about this hotel? Oh, okay. Just walking through, wandering through the town. Can I ask what was intriguing about it? Mm. Mm. Yeah, this town's pretty popular in the autumn. You usually don't get a room if you don't make a reservation, but you're pretty lucky we have a few left tonight. Alright, and then let me go over some of the amenities you have while staying here. So first, this is the sheet with all the details you need about check-in and check-out, along with our pool hours and our quiet hours. And if you have any further questions, feel free to call the front desk. So yeah, we actually do have a few hot springs on our property, which makes this place very popular. The lake is not part of our property, it is public property, and you're free to swim there as well. Um, it is a little bit further away, so we recommend that you either walk on one of the trails or drive if you're gonna, like, bring a boat or something. <laughs> we do have a pool as well. It's an indoor-outdoor pool, and since it is kind of chilly outside, I would recommend indoors. But if you want, you feel free to swim outside in the hot tub as well. We also offer room service, and that's actually going to be on our menu. So we, so we have breakfast in the morning along with a dinner served from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. And breakfast is 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. daily. So I can give you this menu here to look over. If you ever want to order room service, again, just call this front desk and I will help you with that. We also have a few bar options, but if you're not interested in that, we have coffee and tea and water and all that good stuff. Yeah, it's not too late to order room service tonight. My personal recommendation is the King Salmon with the roasted potatoes. We also have a few other options, but it is a hotel restaurant, so we don't have a ton. But I hope you find something you enjoy. As for the bar, if you get a wine, we can send up a chilled wine for you. 
And one of my favorite cocktails is the spicy bourbon pumpkin. It's very seasonal and autumnal, so if you're in for that, there's that. We also serve Coke products, too. Yeah, I can actually order something for you right now, and that way you can get it pretty much as soon as you get to your room. Yeah, let me put in an order request. So, what would you like? And for your side, okay, sounds great. And do you have any drinks you'd like with that? Even water, I can put that down. Okay, that works. And would you like to pay this bill now or at the end of your stay? All right, that's no problem. Let me just add your room number. Speaking of room number, I don't think I gave you your key, which is very important to get to where you need to go. So. All right, and your room number is 19. So here's the key for this. It'll be, once you go down this hallway and to your right, you should see it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we do have um, manual keys. <laughs> Old fashioned, I guess. We don't have the key cards just yet. We are relatively new, so maybe later we'll get key cards. But for now, the good old fashioned keys for you. And is this your first time in the area? Wow, you picked a great time to come. Well, um, since you are here for the first time, and it's your first time in the area, we do get to give you a little welcome basket. So let me get that very quickly. This basket is yours to keep. So in it, we have your do not disturb sign. Don't worry, you would have gotten this anyway but it's nice and in here for you. We have some hot chocolate packs, some green tea packets, some fuzzy socks because trust me, it gets a little chilly at night and these are an essential. We also are giving you this little candle. The scent is cinnamon caramel swirl. So it smells amazing. You're gonna love it. And then, as a little treat, since it is the Halloween time, we added two little stuffies for you. Um, they're little ghosts. One's a little ghost bear, and one's just a little ghost with a little bow tie. And those are just for you to keep. They're cute, and, you know, happy Halloween and stuff like that. So I will just leave this here for you to take back to your room. Normally, we do put them on the bed, but we weren't sure who was coming in today. Mm -hmm. And do you have any other questions for me, or do you think you got everything? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so if you do need stuff to do tomorrow, there is a fall festival in town, and that pretty much runs all day from about 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. And then there is a bonfire at night as well, starting at 9 p.m. till midnight, which you know is great to go and roast some marshmallows and s'mores and stuff like that. But yeah, at the fall festival tomorrow, there are hay rides, there's a pumpkin carving contest, there is apple bobbing, and a few other things along with vendors and food trucks. So it's definitely something you should get down to if you're not too busy hiking or swimming. Mm hmm Yeah, so I know people have said that this place is haunted, and I promise you, if it is haunted, the ghosts are very friendly. They're not going to be a bother to you. Yeah, it's part of the charm, I think. You know, I think ghosts are pretty nice. So, all right. So you have your welcome basket with all your stuff. You have your key. And this menu and the flyer are yours to keep. So you can, you know, double check times. And if you need anything else, or if you want to eat anything else, you can look over the menu. 
And do you have any other questions for me? No? Okay, awesome. Well, you're all checked in. Everything is good to go. Your food has been ordered, and it should be up to your room shortly. Um, yeah, well, that's really it for me. If you have any questions or need anything, feel free to ring up the front desk, and I'll be happy to help you. All right, well, have a good night, and have a good trip this weekend. Thank you.